this is your King of the Night, Vince Belt. I'm EX Turk with another Final Fantasy thing to talk about. And we're going to be talking about the anniversary of Final Fa uh, the, uh, the 30th anniversary of Final Fantasy. It's coming up. It's getting good. It's getting juicy. We're getting more content than we than we ever could have before. Now, so what are the good predictions we're gonna have on the Final Fantasy 30th anniversary? Which was which? I think the festival will be tomorrow. I think tomorrow. I don't know what's central, but uh, my predictions will be more. Hopefully, more. Um, more gameplay of the Final Fantasy 7 remake. I bet you know. At least a trailer with Tifa and Sephiroth in it. That'd be nice if they can actually have that. That would be pretty cool, you know. I mean, I doubt it, but at the same time, it could happen. It could happen. Let's just keep our minds open for the 30th anniversary. That Kingdom Hearts 1.1, well, of course, I think that's been announced before, so, you know, I don't think that's going to be in there. Although, we are going to get, um, uh, I think we're going to get, like, a little sneak peek of... Final Fantasy 12, the Zodiac Chronicles HD Collection. If it's the HD Collection or a different game, we don't know yet. But looks like we might get a second trailer, which and an actual release date on that, which will actually help us because some of us want to play Final Fantasy 12 on the PS4. You know, we have the 10 HD Collection released two times, and let's just be quite honest, 12 is deserving of an HD Collection. So we're gonna have that, and you know, again. They might tease a little Kingdom Hearts 3, at least I hope they tease Kingdom Hearts 3, at least I hope. Because we all been waiting, just like the Final Fantasy 7 Remake, we all, right now, since Final Fantasy 15, no offense, has failed because of the ending in Chapter 13. We need Final Fantasy 7 Remake and we need Kingdom Hearts 3 to repair the reputation Square Enix has. We need to have, you know, we need we need those games. We we desperately need the Final Fantasy VII remake and Kingdom Hearts three. Now they might t tease some, they might actually tease some new stuff in there too. So you keep your eyes out for that. I think they're gonna probably tease Final Fantasy sixteen because I'm not gonna ca just call it. Uh, I'm not gonna call Angie's philosophy Crystallium Novi Fabula Crystallium Novia because it's like. You know they're going to do the same thing they did at 15. They're going to wait a few more times. Sure. They always tease their stuff at their earliest. They always tease their stuff super early. Then it's not even, you know, in full develop. Which, you know, gets kind of discouraging, if you know what I mean. But, um, nonetheless, um, when they do that. But, you know, they're going to do that. And then they're going to wait. And then once Tabata or somebody else takes over that Angie's Philosophy Project... It'll be renamed Final Fantasy 16, so it won't even have the Crystallium Novias connected to it. So, with that to say that um, that Final Fantasy, uh, we might see a little sneak peek of Final Fantasy 16 because they always do that, even though 15 is still going on. You know they really plan to want to make a 16. I mean, Final Fantasy is a huge cash cow. Let's just be quite honest. I don't think Final, I, don't, I can't really see Final Fantasy ending, which. You know, I mean, I said there might be an omen to it in my last previous video. That there might actually be an omen to, um... There might actually be an omen to it ending because the Final Fantasy Versus 13 became Final Fantasy 15. And they're releasing Kingdom Hearts 3 and Final Fantasy 7 Remake. Which, if you were part of the fan base, if you were part of the fan base, you, uh, you knew that was the omen that Final Fantasy was going to end because... Those are the games that they had the hardest time releasing. And with Final Fantasy XV being released, even though it's not Versus 13 anymore, the fact it's released and the fact we got even more trailer, more coverage of what is going to happen to Kingdom Hearts 3 and what's going to happen to Final Fantasy 7 Remake, this could be a bad omen But I don't of Final Fantasy any. But then again, I d hardly doubt it. I, I think they're working on Angie's philosophy right now, which that's probably going to be teased during the 30th anniversary. And because it being teased during the 30th anniversary, in, in anniversary means that they're planning, they're pr probably gonna keep planning to continue making more Final Fantasy games. I think right now, at their 16, it probably be the time when PlayStation 4 is about to end and a new system take its place. But we don't know yet. We don't know yet. PlayStation 4 may get four or five years, just like PlayStation 2, 2 has. So we don't know yet. Because PlayStation 4 seems to be the most solid console to play on. And thought out console to play on. So, 
And yeah, since I'm a little bit biased, I put, you know, but I have played Xbox One. Xbox One's good for what it does, and it has the reverse compatibility. But let's just be quite honest. Uh, Sony has the most superior or um, superior hardware, but that's just my opinion right there. But I think it's going to continue for three or four years, so I, I don't know. I can't really say that uh, Angie's Philosophy or Final Fantasy 16. Uh, I, I would say for sure Final Fantasy 16 will be the end of all Final Fantasy, you know, be the end of Final Fantasy because they're, they're going to want to continue it. Until it stops making money completely, which if I, I, I have a theory, because I think they're gonna release Final Fantasy Seven Remake and Kingdom Hearts Three first, so they can have the extra money. Because I mean, yes, for the first two weeks, Final Fantasy Fifteen has brought profit in because it was a good game. But then when we got to the ending, people got disappointed and got a lower score than usual, which understandably so. Because chapter 13 need to be fixed. Don't just put a patch on it. They should have had. They should have kept some of the stuff they need to. At least answer the questions we all wanted. To, we all wanted to hear. So we ha we are depending on the Final Fantasy 7 remake, and we are depending on Kingdom Hearts 3. But I think you know. Then after that, I think they'll have enough money to make Angie's Philosophy as Final Fantasy 16. And oh, and if and now if now if Angie's Philosophy or Final Fantasy 16 fails in the future then they're probably gonna lose money for Final Fantasy and then Final Fantasy might come to an end again that's just based on speculation and an omen I made before my previous video I don't really think that's gonna be the case I think they're gonna still try to push more Final Fantasy uh, you know as much as they do Kingdom Hearts it would be nice if they gave a Final Fantasy uh, a rest right now focus on Kingdom Hearts games Deus Ex Nier and stuff like that you know, or also, you know, or try to port the other Final Fantasy games and other consoles and and handheld consoles, you know. That's what they've been, you know, just do that. But otherwise, you know, I, I gotta be quite honest. To be quite honest, we are depending on Final Fantasy. We are dependent on, we are dependent on the Final Fantasy 7 remake. And we are dependent upon the Kingdom Hearts 3. But it looks like they might tease it, they might not. I know 12 is going to get teased, probably. I'm for a fact that it's going to get teased. But the remake trailer, the, another remake trailer, um, we don't know. It could, it could not. If we don't see it there, then you know we don't see it there. But um, I think Angie's philosophy is a higher chance of being, you know, shown off because it's going to be possibly Final Fantasy 16. Let's just be quite honest. The quick con just and and these philosophy. Let's just be quite honest with ourselves and just call it what it is: Final Fantasy 16. And I guess that's pretty much what I got my input for the Final Fantasy 30th 30th anniversary right there. So may the crystal be with you guys. I'm going to end this right now. I got more work. I got all extra work to do.